Salatu wa salamu ala nabiyyina Muhammadin wa ala alihi wa ashabihi wa azwajihi ajma'in Amma ba'd fa'awdhu billahi min ash-shaytan ar-rajim bismillahi r-rahman r-rahim Rabbish rahli sadri wa yassir li amri wa hlul uqtatam min lisani yafqahu qawli Rabbi zidni ilman ajma'in insha'Allah May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala increase in all of us knowledge. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Nice to see you brothers and sisters. We will continue from where we left yesterday. Are you with me brothers and sisters? Ayyin shart wa jawab shart fi mayati. Wa idha kana al jawabu muqtarinan bil fai. فَذْكُرْ سَبَبَ ذَلِكَ Are you with me? If the jawabu shart is connected with fa, then mention the reason for that. Okay? Keep your highlighters and your pencils all ready. These are the verses from the Quran, brothers and sisters. قَالَ تَعَالَى What is تَعَالَى? Form 6. What is it? Form 6. Ya ayyuhal ladheena amanu Iza kumtum So iza has come. So what is kumtum? So this is your fialu shart. Now again I mention, brothers and sisters, that Dr. Abdurrahim says the conditional sentence has two parts. One is shart and one is jawab shart. And I, you know, for the sake of simplicity, I said three parts. Adratu shart, fairlu shart, 
and jawab is shart. Now when you make it two parts, the first part is shart, it contains adhatu shart and fi'al shart. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? It contains adhatu shart and fi'al shart. So, iza kum tum ila salati, now this is your shart. Are you with me? Do you find adhatu shart? Yes. And the fi'al shart? Yes. Sir. So keep that in mind. Okay? So, when iza comes, the translation is in future. Kum tum is past, but you will translate in present and future tense. How will you translate? If you stand for salah or if you establish salah. Uh, if you are about to establish salah, fagasilu. Uh, what is this fagasilu? Now this is your jawab, uh, And why did fa come? Talab. Amar? Uh, uh, Amar, uh, brother, sister uh, Manas, sister Mamuna, Amar, Lamo Amar, La Nahia, and Istifham. These four things uh, denote Talab. Uh, these four things denote Talab. I repeat again Amar, Lamo Amar, La Nahia, and Istifham. These four things denote talab. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? So that is why we had to bring in fa. Fa gisilu. Wash. Wujuha kum. Wujuha is your mafulun bihi. Fa gisilu. Where is the file? Wow. Inshallah. We watch all these things, brothers and sisters. Wujuha is your mafulun bihi. Mudaf. Mudaf ilayhi. Wa at harfu atfin. So what is idea mautufun ala wujuha? Why it is idea? What is the actual noun? Uh, do you remember? You got to also remember this, huh? Uh? Yadun. What is the plural? Mankus. What is it? Mankus. Aydin, if it is marfu, it will be Aydin. If it is majroor, it will be Aydin. But if it is mansu, then the fatha will come. Huh? So that is why it became Aydiya. Are you with me? And then the kum came. Huh? Inshallah you will remember. Whenever the nouns are mankus, inshallah, you will be able to identify them, figure them out, inshallah. Ilal marafiki, till your elbows. Huh? Okay? Wam sahu and, brother, wipe. Wam sahu means wipe. Huh? With water. Huh? Be ru'usikum. What is ru'usi? Hey, what is singular? Rasun. Huh? Rasun. Wa arjula. What is arjula? Feet. What is singular? Rijulun. Huh? Rijulun. Huh? Will you please remember? Shall I write it down? Or you, you have an idea? Huh? Okay, I'll write down that. Rasun. Ru'usun. Huh? Rijulun. Arjulun. Huh? Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Ilal kabaini. Ankle. Now, our jawabu shart will only be fagsilu. The rest of them are mautufun. Eh? Are you with me? The rest of them are mautufun. Eh? Number two, brothers and sisters, 
قال تعالى إذا مرضت فهو يشفيني It's only Allah who cures us. Okay? Of course, the doctor helps us, but it's Allah who actually cures us. So, is a maritu. How will you translate this, brothers and sisters? When I get sick. So, we have to translate present and future. When I get sick, or if I get sick, for who were. Fuck him. Why? No, brother. Jumlatun ismiyatun. Jawabu shart, jumlatun ismiyatun. In the previous one, jawabu shart, jumlatun talabiyatun. Uh, or you can say, uh, you can say in the first one, jawabu shart, uh, fi'alun talabiyun. Fi'alun talabiyun. Uh, and in this you will say, Jumlatun ismiyatun. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? In the first sentence, we will say, Fagsilu jawabu shart fe'alun talabiyun. And in the second, Fahuwa yashfini, we will say, jawabu shart jumlatun ismiyatun. Inshallah. Now, Dr. Sahib has already explained, huh? Yashfini. What is this noon there? Noonu vikaya. It is actually Shafa Yashfi. Are you with me? Shafa Yashfi. Shafa Yashfi. Okay, and then Noonu vikaya. And then, Ya Mutakallim. Okay? He cures me. He restores my health. But, this is dropped. So what are you left with? You are only left with this. Huh? Okay? So, this also, we have to remember. Huh? I jokingly say, Ya Mutakallim Aiti, Apne Nishani Chorke, she came, she left her sign, and she went away. Huh? So, Kasra is her sign. Huh? Okay, got the idea, brothers and sisters? Inshallah. Another nice uh, 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 verse, brothers and sisters. Kala ta'ala, Ya ayyuhal ladheena amanu, Iza, nudiya. What is nudiya? Majhul. What is the... Nada, huh? Nada yunadi. So Nada became, brothers and sisters, Nada became, see, Na, if I say Nu, sister Gulshan, if I say Nu, that Alif change into Wow. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Huh? Nu, and then D, as soon as I put a kasra, ya became visible. Huh? Nu diya. Huh? Iza nu diya, lis salati. Iza nu diya, lis salati. Min yomil jumati, fas au. Again, fa came. Jawabusha. Huh? Jawabusha. Uh, what is the reason? Talab. Huh? Jawabusha. Fialun talabiyun. Fialun talabiyun. Okay, brothers and sisters? Okay. What kind of a verb is this? Sa'a yas'a. What is it? Sa'a yas'a. To go quickly, to walk quickly. Sa'a yas'a. Ah. How did you make Amar from there? Okay, brother and sister. Conjugate this. Are you ready? Yes, ah. Yes, ayani. Yes, avna. Ah, mashallah, mashallah. Excellent. Eh? Ah. So if it is tas, 
Auna. How do I make Amar? Huh? I chop this, and I chop this, and I bring Hamzatul Vasal, Hamzaf Amar. Huh? So it has to be Is. Huh? But if I put Waw, then it will become Wasaw. Huh? Are you with me? Wasaw. Huh? And if you put Fa, Fasaw. Huh? Fasaw. So it is Talab. Where is the file? Wow. Antum. Uh, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is addressing us, all of us, that you should hurry up. Uh, to where? Hurry up to where? Ila zikrillah. Uh, Ila zikrillah. Uh, okay. Uh, then there is a wall. I want you to separate this wall, otherwise you will get confused. Either you circle it, and if you have two colors of highlighter, use one color for wall and the other color for the room. Now, this is something, again, we want to study properly. And today I'm going to write a lot of things on the board, brothers and sisters. Huh? There are two verbs that I'm writing. They are not used in Mahdi. Huh? The words are there. The verbs are there. But they are not used in Mahdi. They are used in Amar most of the time and also in Mudharia. Huh? The first verb is Vazira. Huh? Huh? What is this verb? Vazira. Misal al Wavi. Huh? And the second verb is Vada. Are you with me? What is the meaning of these two words? Taraka. To leave. Huh? Meaning is taraka. So, Vazira, give me Mudariya, brothers and sisters. Yaza. Yaza. Huh? Because Bab Daraba, it will change into Vada. Vada is Yada. Ooh. How do you make? How do you make? Amar. Huh? We only chop this. Huh? And you give sukun here. So what will be the Amar for Vazira? Zar. Huh? And this will be Da. Huh? Da. Utruk. What is the meaning of Da utruk, leave. Okay. Now you see, tazaru, tazaruna. What will be? Tazaruna. Make amar. Huh? Chop here and chop here. This is your amar. Huh? Leave utruku. Huh? Utruku. Okay, so Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is saying, Vazaru, what should you leave? Al buy. Huh? Buying and selling. Business. Huh? Huh? Buy. Huh? Are you with me? What is buy un? Master. From where, Sister Hafsa? Ba'a yabi'u. Huh? Ba'a yabi'u, buy un. Huh? Buying, selling. Huh? Okay. You have the idea, brothers and sisters? Now, you know how many beautiful verbs we are, you know, uh, understanding, alhamdulillah. Huh? Huh? See, the, these are not easy verbs. Huh? If you say, fas'aw, sa'a is, is, you know, when you study book two, at the end of it, you come across these things. Uh, so it requires a lot of effort on the part of student uh, to understand the verbs. And it is the beauty of uh, the books of Dr. Abdul Rahim. The way he has designed this course, we understand it. And inshallah, we can, uh, when see in the Quran, 
we can uh, understand and feel it, inshallah. Hmm? Alhamdulillah. So, fast out, wazaru. Huh? Okay? These are both amar. But we are only concerned with fast out, because that is our jawabu shart. Huh? Okay. Number four, brothers and sisters. Is a dakhala ahdukumul masjida. What is the meaning of it? When one of you enters the masjid, fal huh? yarka. Again, fa came. What is it? Lamu amar. So this is talab. Huh? Okay? Rakataini. Kabla an yajlis. Alhamdulillah. Kala ta'ala. Fa'idha ja. Now, this fa in the beginning is harfu atf. Huh? Do not get confused. This is harfu atfin. Fa'idha huh? ja ajluhum. Ajlu means the final time. The mouth. Huh? When the mouth comes, their death comes. La yastakhiruna. What kind of a verb is this? Farm tem. Istakhara. To delay. Huh? And the same way we have is takdama. Huh? To, to bring it forward. Huh? Okay, brothers and sisters, where is our jawabu shart? La yastakhiruna. No, fa didn't come. There is no need for fa. Why? Ji? This is La Nafia. It's not La Nahia, it is La Nafia. Huh? And none of these apply there. Are you? Yasta Hiruna. See? Huruna. What is it? Marfu. It's not Majizuma or anything. So there is no need for Fa. It is Jawabu Shart, Sister Sukhaina, but it does not need Fa. Uh, so you will have to figure out, brother and sister, there will be, there'll be many uh, jawabushat which will not need fa. And there will be many which will need fa. Uh, so this does not need fa. So when you say jawabushat, would you just say la yastakhiruna ta'atan and then that's the jawabushat? Yes. Ma'atufun ala. Exactly, you are right. You are right. Uh, alhamdulillah. Mashallah. You see, now you are you are getting very sharp. Huh? And you are now understanding very well. Alhamdulillah. Brothers and sisters, number six is hadith. Huh? Ida sharibal kalbu fi enai ahidikum from the container or a pot of one of you if a, the dog drinks from your container or pot Huh? What you should do? Fal yagsil. Then you should wash. Seven times. Okay? Now here, where is the jawabu shart? Fal yagsil. Uh, what is it? Lama mahal. So it is talab. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Alhamdulillah. Is a samiyatum bitta'uni. What is ta'un? Slave. Huh? Play. Huh? If you hear play, fi ardin. See, fi ardin. What is the meaning of ardin? In a country, in a place. Huh? This does not mean the whole earth. This means a country, huh? a place. Huh? Any country. Fi ardin means any country. Huh? Fala tadhuluha, and then do not enter it. So la came. What kind of a la is this? La nahiya. So if it is la nahiya, now then it is a talab. So now if it is a talab, then we need fa. Fala tadhuluha. Wa ida waka bi and if it and if it happens or if it occurs in the country. Antum biha and you are in it, huh? Fala takhruju 
minha. Then do not go out of it. Huh? Are you with me, brothers and sisters? So you got the idea? Twice, Ida came, twice, Shart came, and you, you have two Jawabu Shart, huh? inshallah. Brothers and sisters, number eight is very meaningful, extremely meaningful. I will say something. If you don't like my statement, then please forgive me. But I feel like saying it, you know. Iza naasa ahdukum. What is the meaning of naasa ahdukum? What is the meaning of naasa? To feel drowsy. Huh? Yawn. You drowsy. Okay? Feel sleepy. If you feel sleepy, and that during the time of salah, or when the salah time has come, and if you feel sleepy, go to sleep. Don't pray. Huh? But there is a wisdom in it. Huh? Sleep. Huh? What is it? إِذَا نَأَسَ أَحْدُكُمْ فِي salati. If you feel sleepy in the salah, huh? you better sleep. Huh? Falyanam. Why? Lamu Amar. Huh? So Talab. Falyanam. Hatta until till Ya Lama huh? Ma Yakarao. Huh? Until you are in a position that when you, uh, uh, you you know what you are saying in your salah. It means you are awake and you are alert. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Huh? If you are sleepy in the salah, you sleep. And then we are fresh. Huh? Until you are fresh and you know what you are saying in the salah. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Huh? So, hatta, brothers and sisters, hatta ya'lama. What is ya'lama? Mansu, why? Because an, an. What is madmur? What is uh, hidden? Hatta. This is this is hidden. Huh? What is hidden? An is hidden. An is what made the. Fail Mudarya, Mansu. Got the idea? Okay? So, An is hidden. Okay? Hatta An. Now, this is what made, this is what made the Fail Mudarya, Mansu. Huh? Okay? Inshallah. Now, the point is this, brothers and sisters, that this is the Hadith of Rasul Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. That when you feel sleepy in the salah, don't pray. Because you don't know what you are saying in the salah. But our tragedy is that even when we are awake, we don't know what we are praying. Rasul Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam says, if you feel sleepy, you should not pray because you don't know what you are saying. Till you are fresh and you know what you are saying. But our trage tragedy is that even when we are awake, we don't understand what we are saying. So what shall we do now? How much benefit are we going to drive from the Salah? This is something to ponder over. Huh? That we must understand our Salah, what we are saying, what is happening in the salah? Huh? Otherwise, the benefit is very minimal. Brother and sister. Now, this hadith is an awakening call for all of us. That we must learn. Huh? And how will you know what you are saying in the salah? Because salah is in Arabic. How will you know? You have to learn Arabic. You have to learn Arabic. In order to know what we are saying in the salah, huh, brother and sister. 
And if you learn only translation, uh, it's okay. But better if we learn the language. Then you can communicate with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, brothers and sisters. Remember, in Salah, we are getting very intimate with Allah. Are you with me then? Trust me, brother. If there's an intimate relation between Abd and the Khalik. Huh? And it happens in the Salah. Because you are communicating with the Creator, your Lord, your Rabb. Uh, and if you don't know, brothers and sisters, if I stand in front of you and I say something that I really don't know what I'm saying to you, you know, what will you, what will you feel about me? Uh, what kind of opinion you will have about me? That this person doesn't know what he's saying. Huh? Uh, what an ignorant person he is. So we got to, brothers and sisters, inshallah, learn Quran, learn the language of the Quran, and then that knowledge will create khushu and khuzu in our salah. Huh? And then when you will pray, you will have a different feeling, brothers and sisters. The happiness and joy, only you will feel and understand. And satisfaction and the sakina that you will derive out of your prayers, uh, inshallah, it will become part of you, inshallah. Next one, brother and sister, well, this is also very important. When the ikama is uh, said, you know, people will still pray their sunnah. Uh, they don't quit. That's not right. Ida uh, ukimat. Salatu. Ukimat. What is ukimat? Form four majo. Akama uki mum. And the knife file is salatu. So we have tautanisi. Got the idea? What is the word, brother and sister? Akama became uki. Is a uki? Mat. Huh? So, Akama became Ukima, Majhul. Is a Ukima tis salatu. Huh? When the salat, again it is Ira, when the Ikama is called and the salat is about to begin, hmm? Fala salata. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Fala salata. Okay, Fa has come. What kind of a sentence is this? Jumla ismiya. Huh? What is la salata? La nafiyatu lil jins. There is absolutely, absolutely no kind of salah. Huh? This is la nafiyatu lil jins. Absolutely no kind of a salah is permissible except illa al maktubatu what is prescribed and what is prescribed fard huh? what is the prescribed salah fard so when the ikrama is called then we must stop everything because at that time the only thing that is uh, fard on us is our fard salah huh? are you with me brothers and sisters very important you can write down one word underneath Maktubatu, mafrudatu. Huh? Al mafrudatu. What is the meaning of al mafrudatu? Huh? Enjoined. What is it? Enjoined. Obligatory. Huh? Fard, you know, imposed. Huh? Decreed. That is the meaning of. Mafru Datun. It comes from Fard. Kal Shair, a poet said, Iza Lam Tastati. What kind of a verb is this? Form 10. Istata Yastati U Lam Tastati. Shayan. 
if you cannot do something, for da who see da, wada da utruk, huh? So far came. Amar talab, are you with me? Amar, huh? Wada da utruk who? Wajavis. What is the meaning of Javis? Huh? Write down, brothers and sisters. Javaza. This is form three. And then we have Tajavaza. This is form six. The meaning is same. To do something very well. To do something extremely well. To do uh, something extremely well. Are you with me, brother? So, Javaza, you Javizu, what will be the Amar? Javiz. Huh? Javiz, who means you do it. Ilama tastatiu, what you can do. So do something what you can do extremely well. Leave the other thing and do what you can do extremely well. Huh? Is it clear, brothers and sisters? For Javid's who? Ilama, here ma is al lazi, huh, brother? Vajavizhu ila ma tastatiyo. What you can do? Very well. Hmm? What can you can you can do extremely well? Leave the other. Huh? Are, are you with me, brothers and sisters? Fine. Yes, sister Memuna. Ida lam tastati. What is the meaning of? Lam tasati. He could not do. Huh? Huh? But b- because of Iza, how will you translate it? If you cannot do. Are you with me? If he cannot do, you will change Lam tasati into present tense. Why? Because of Iza. Huh? When the Iza comes, brothers and sisters, mostly. Fail Mahdi will come. Are you with me? And the Fail Mahdi will uh, will be uh, translated as a future. Huh? So tell me one thing, brother and sister. Tastati, is it Mahdi Mudarya? Mudarya. But Lam came. So what did Lam do? It made it into Mahdi. What is Lam? Harfu huh? Jasmine. Wa nafiyin wa qalbin. It trans, transfers mudariya into madi. Okay? So this lam tastati is madi. But again, idha came and it, we translate it now in future. Are you with me? How will you translate? If you cannot, huh? now leave idha and just say lam tastati. How will you translate lam tastati? You did not. Uh, you did not. Now bring Iza. Uh, you cannot. Uh, are you with me? Are you with me? It will change into future. Uh, inshallah. You got to understand. Huh? Sister uh, Bamula, uh, with Iza, most of the time translation is in present or future. Huh? Okay. Now, we got to learn a lot about these verbs. When it is Iza, we should not worry. Because the translation will be in the present and future. Huh? We will be more concerned when we have other instruments of Shart. Which, inshallah, we are going to learn today. Huh? Inshallah. Okay. Call uh, Shauki Yun. Brothers and sisters, who is Shauki? A very famous Egyptian poet. A very, very famous. Yes, Sister Naima, you are saying something? 
Yes, yes. Okay. If you cannot do anything, Shayan means something. If you cannot do something uh, nicely, it is understood that you cannot do something well, what you then leave it. Vajav is who and do it what you can do very well. Huh? And do it very well what you can. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? So there are many things we are good at. Huh? If you are good at cooking biryani, then cook biryani only. <laughs> <laughs> Don't 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 uh, cook baklava because you are not good at it. Huh? You'll make a mess of it. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Okay. Now, this uh, poet Shauki, uh, he is uh, saying in the praise of Rasul Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Fi madhi madhi means praise. Huh? What is he saying? Is a rahimta. If you show mercy, fa'anta ummun wa abun. You are the mother and father of the ummah. Our uh, brother and sister. He's, he's praising Rasul Sallallahu that you, we look to you as our mother and father. Uh, we respect you. Uh, so, is a rahimta. So again, rahimta is madi, but translation will be present tense. If you show mercy, huh? you are our mother and father. Fa'anta, what kind of a sentence is this? Jumla ismiya. The fa came. Huh? Alhamdulillah. Brothers and sisters, now there's a beautiful exercises, but you got to do it. Will you make an attempt at home? You can even write down verses from the Quran if you wish. Huh? Or from the hadith, if you wish. Adkhil idha fi jumlataini ala an yakuna jawabuha khaliyan min fa. You got to make two sentences with iza in which you need not use fa. It means these conditions should not come. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Okay. So you got to figure out, you know. Is a ja Ramadanu Futihat Abu Abul Jannah. So that is one sentence. Uh, like that you can figure out your own sentence. Uh, simple sentence. Uh. And now next one is Adhil Ida Fi Arbay Jumlin Alan Yakuna Jawabu. Four sentences you got to make in which there's a jawab, jumla ismiya, then there's a jawab, amar, then lamu amar, and then la nahya. Huh? Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Will you give it a try? G? No, no, no. See, uh, I was just talking to uh, Sister Sukhaina about this. إِذَا زُلْزِلَتِ الْأَرْضُ زِلْزَالَهَا وَأَخْرَجَتِ الْأَرْضُ أَثْقَالَهَا وَقَالَ الْإِنسَانُ مَا لَهَا Now the jawab comes. تُحَدِّسُ أَخْبَارَهَا تُحَدِّسُ أَخْبَارَهَا This is your jawab. And there is no need for fire. Are you with me? But then I again gave her another example. Iza jaa nasrullahi wal fat wa raita nasa yadkhuluna fi deen allahi afwaja fa sabbih sabbih amar form 2 sabbaha yusabbihu sabbih now the fa comes. And is this there? Fa sabbi. Okay? But you got to make your own sentence, simple sentence. Is a aratta. Is a aratta. Antazaba ila suki. 
Are you with me? Fasayarati fi khidmatikum. What did I say? My car is at your service. Huh? Fasayarati. So what is sayarati? Muptada. Huh? So it is a jumla. Ismiya. You make your own sentence. And make amar also, you know. Okay? Uh, simple sentence. Huh? Okay? For this is a yeah, you can, you can, inshallah, you can figure out. إِذَا جَاءَ أَتُّلَّابُ مُتَأْخِرِينَ What did I say? مُتَأْخِرِينَ No, that is your hal. In what condition they come? Late. فَلَا تَسْمَحْ لَهُ Do not allow them. Huh? Are you with me? So, فَلَا تَسْمَحْ Lahum. So here it is la nahiya. Are you with me? Inshallah you will try to figure out. Do you want me to give you? You want to write it down or you will inshallah make an effort? Uh, brothers and sisters, make an effort. Uh, inshallah. And you know, you can always exchange your sentences with each other. Even on phone. And finally you can take help from the hello tamari. Inshallah. Now, we come to lesson number 15. My favorite lesson, brothers and sisters. Everything is in the lesson, brothers and sisters. I'm writing on the board so that we can refer it all the time. Now, we did love. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Harf imtinai, lim tinai. And then we did idha. What are they? Huh? Love is particle of shart. But what kind of a particle it is? Gairo jasimin. It does not give jazam to any mudariya. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? What is idha? Ismu shart. Love is harfu shart. Idha is ismu shart. Again, same thing. Gairu jazimin. Huh? Now, we did a little bit of in, remember? What is in? Harfu shart. Again, it is particle of shart. But jazimun. It will give jasam to fial mudariya. Lazim, lazim. Huh? It is mandatory. In will make fial mudariya majzum. Lazim. Mandatory. Huh? And what will man do? Same thing. But what is the difference between in and man? Harf and man. Huh? Okay. Now, in this uh, lesson, Dr. Abdurrahim is giving us about 10 kinds of ism. Ismu shart. 10 kinds. And only one harf. 
And what is that one harf? N. Huh? The rest are all Asam. Now, mind you, there are more. There are more uh, particles and Asam. But you see, Dr. Abdurrahim is taking only those which are constantly in use. If something is rarely used or there is a grammar rule not very common, uh, Dr. Abdurrahim has left it out. Huh? But things which are very common in terms of instrument of shart, Dr. Abdurrahim is tackling them in the book. Huh? So in this lesson, brothers and sisters, we will now uh, learn the instrument of shart which are jazimun. Are you with me? Which are Jazimun. So if the instrument of shart is jazimun, brother and sister, it is it is it is in its natural condition. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? For example, huh? if I tell you what did I say? In Tashtahid Tanja. Now, this Tashtahid is its a natural uh, condition. Asal. If in comes, the Fialu Shart has to be Majzum. And if it is Mudarya. Are you with me? If Mudarya comes after in, it has to be Majzum. And then the Jawabu Shart has to be Majzum. Okay. But suppose instead of fail mudarya, fail madi comes. What happens now? How will you describe it? Fi mahali jasmin. MashaAllah. MashaAllah. You got the idea? Same our old method of describing. Huh? If madi comes, we will describe the verb as a madi. And then what will you say? Fi mahali jasmine. Because originally it has to be chasam. Are you with me? Now, tanja. It is your job, shart, majzum. Suppose if it is jumla ismiya coming as a job, shart. Then you will say, fi mahali jasmine. Are you with me? So how easy it becomes once we have that concept in our mind, well understood. Huh? If it is not in this condition, if it is something else, then we will say, Fi Mahali Jasmine. Are you with me? Now, I'm going to repeat this a lot, brothers and sisters, so that you understand. It took me quite a while to understand, but Alhamdulillah, when I understood it, uh, I want to share with you everything, brothers and sisters. Now, whenever fa will come uh, in the jawab ushad, when the fa will come, when these conditions are there, uh, okay? And even if you have amar, which is already majzum, or if you have a lam amar, it is Majzum. If you are La Nahiya, it is Majzum. But they are Majzum because of other things. They are not Majzum in its original situation. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Huh? And most of them will have Fa in it. Are you with me? Because if they are Talabi, Jamit, Ma, and Nafiya, and Lan, and Kad, and this is Seen and Saufa, the Fa will come. In other words, the Fail, Jawabu Shart will not be in its natural position. So what will you say in that case? Fi Mahali Jasmine. Now, brothers and sisters, again, I want to make it very easy for you, inshallah. I will try to make it very easy for you. Because once you understand, then it is very easy, brothers and sisters. Watch carefully, brother. 
There are two kinds of sentences. Are you with me? What are they? Ismi and Pedia. So all this thing will be either Jumla Ismiya or Jumla Felia coming as a Jawabu Shart. Are you with me? They will come as a Jawabu Shart. So in other words, the Jawabu Shart, if it is supposed to be Majzum and it is not there, and now instead a Jumla Ismiya has come, or Jumla Felia has come. So how will you describe? Fi Mahali Jasmin Jawabu Shart. You will say Al Jumlatul Ismiyatu Fi Mahali Jasmin Jawabu Shart. Or you will say Al Jumlatul Fialiyatu Fi Mahali Jasmin Jawabu Shart. And watch for it. And watch for it, brothers and sisters. Most of the time it will be either Ismiyatun, Talabiyatun, Abhi Jamid, Abhi Ma, Vallan. Now we are going to study this and watch for it. And I'll be repeating it. Huh? But inshallah, this my explanation, brothers and sisters, will, will make a, uh, things much easier for you. Huh? You won't be, uh, you know, lost. You'll be, inshallah, uh, understanding it very well, inshallah. But again, as I said yesterday to you, brothers and sisters, you got to memorize this. What do you have to memorize? The song. <laughs> or this line of poetry. Are you with me? Ismiyatun talabiyatun Ismiyatun talabiyatun Vabijamed I say it again. Ismiyatun talabiyatun Vabijamed Vabijamed Vabima Valan Vabikad Vabitan Fees Vabima Valan وَبِكَدْ وَبِتَنْفِيسِ إِسْمِيَةٌ تَلَبِيَةٌ وَبِجَامِدْ وَبِجَامِدْ Alhamdulillah. If you will remember this, things will become halwapuri for you. <laughs> what will they become? Very easy for you, inshallah. So, now we start the lesson. Adarthu al Khamisa Ashar. Inshallah. Lesson number 15. My favorite lesson and one of the most important lessons in book 3. So, inshallah, you will remember this little uh, line of poetry. It is not anywhere in the books. Uh, one of my teachers taught me this and I've been sharing with everybody, you know. If you come across this in any book, please do inform me. I, I am interested. Al Mudaris Ya Ya Siru Inna ka gipta istu aini kamilaini. What's the translation? Complete two weeks. You remain absent for two weeks. Complete. In Taghib. What is in? Harfushat. Huh? What is it? Harfushat. Jazimun. Tajizimu. Fialaini. So where are those two fial? In Taghib. Badhada. Tufsal. See, now those two are coming in its natural state. Are you with me? There is no need for far. There is no need for far. So watch, brother and sister, watch for Adatu Shart, watch for Fialu Shart, and watch for Jawabu Shart. So I want you to make some kind of a marking on your N and Taghib and Tufsal. Huh? Because when you revise it, 
then you will know what's going on in the sentence. And brother and sister, this is the same thing will happen huh, in the Quran. And when you will read the Quran and you will come across these sen sentences, brother, you will feel it in your heart. Because see, now the, the beauty and the eloquence of Quran will come in front of you. And you will be able to understand it, inshallah. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Lillahi ma fis samawati wa ma fil ard. Wa in tubdu. Are you with me? Wa in tubdu ma fi anfusikum aw tukhfuhu. Yuhasib. Are you with me? Yuhasib kum bihi Allah. So here is your in. Uh, and tubdu is your fialushat. Tubdu ma'afi an. What is tubdu? Abda yubdi. Form 4. Uh, abda yubdi. Are you with me? Okay. Let me write down. Huh? Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Sister Manas, if I make spelling mistakes, please correct me. Huh? In, in Tobadu, huh? if you declare it, what is in your heart? Huh? So, what is the verb here, Sister Memuna? Abda. Form 4. In Tobadu ma fi anfusikum. Tubudu. Huh? What is this ma doing here? Ma mausula. What is it doing here? Mafulun bi. What is it? Mafulun bi. Huh? Huh? You declare it. What is in your heart? Au. Tuch. Fu. Who? Huh? What is tukhfu? You hide it. Huh? What is the verb? Akhfa. Form 4. Huh? What is it? Akhfa. Huh? Akhfa yukhfi. Huh? Yukhfi. Huh? Are you with me? Abda. Yubdi. Okay, conjugate brother, yubdi, yubdi, yubdi yani, yubduna. Huh? So you drop the noon. Is Sister Mamuna, is this majzum? Yes, it is majzum. Bi hadifi noon. Why it is majzum? Because it is a fellow shard. Huh? Why it has to be majzum? Because in has come, which is Adhatu shat tajzimu fialaini. Got the idea? This is the way we are going to understand and look at the verses of the Quran. Huh? And what is tukhfu akhfa? Make it mudarya. Yukhfi. Let us conjugate yukhfi. Yukhfi, yukhfiyani, yukhfuna. Huh? Is it majuzum? Yes. Bi asminun. But how came? So this is mautufun ala tubudu. Huh? It is mautufun ala tubudu. This is only your fear shart. Are you with me? You ha sib kum bihi huh? Allahu. What is Allahu? File. 
Are you with me? Allah is the file. You hasib. What is the verb? Hasaba. You hasib form three. Is it majzum? Why? Because it is jawab shart. What is it? <laughs> See, in harfu shart, tajzimu fi'alaini. What is the first fi'al? Tubudu. Huh? And what is the next? Jawab shart. Yuha sebukum bihi. This is your jawab. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Huh? Now, this is the way you will try to understand. Huh? And, brother, there is so much beauty. Huh? And the people who do not know the language, they can read the Quran and they miss out. Huh? And you will see it that there is a conditional sentence huh? in which there is a shart, huh? there is a fearless shart, and there is a jawabu shart. Are you with me? And there are hundreds of such sentences in the Quran. Hundreds of such sentences in the Quran. Do I need far there? Why? Because it's a natural state. Are you with me? Far will only come if these conditions are there. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? When these conditions will come, huh, then we will have to describe Jawabu Shart as a Fi mahalli jazmin. You will remember that. Then you will say, Al jumlatu ismiyatu fi mahalli jazmin jawabu shart. Or you will say, Al jumlatu fi aliyatu fi mahalli jazmin jawabu shart. It's very easy. If we understand, then everything becomes very clear to us, brothers and sisters. And inshallah, what I have tried to explain you in a very simple way, uh, way, brothers and sisters, and you will read the key now, and you will remember my explanation, and you will see that it makes a lot of sense. The things which are not very clear, inshallah, will become very clear to you. Huh? Okay. So, in taghib ba'd haza, tufsal. What is tufsal? Majhul. Huh? What is the verb? Fasala. What is the meaning of fasala? To renounce, to expel. Huh? To, to remove somebody or to fire. If you remain after this, you'll, be, you'll get a pink slip. Huh? You'll be fired. Huh? Tufsal. You are gone then. Okay? Fa inna la What is the la ihata? Regulations. Uh, this is, is your ismu inna tanussu now nasa yanussu means dictates says uh, dictates what what are, what are the regulations saying Allah that annahu man yagib aksar min usbu aini whosoever remains absent for more than two weeks, huh? Yutwa Kaiduhu. Remember, Kaidu has come before. Enrollment. His enrollment will be folded. Means folded. Tawa Yatvi. Huh? I will write down, brother. Tawa Yatvi. Huh? Now, make it into majhul. Tawa, make majhul. Tuviya. 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 Make this majhul. Yutwa. 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 Okay? Sesa Hafsa, make it majhzum. What shall I do? Chop. Got the idea? Failum, mudarium, lil majhul, majzum, 
be as if he has fi illa. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? So, for inna Allahi hata, truly the regulation dictates tanusu Allah after nasa Allah has to come. Are you with me, sister Hafsa? After nasa Allah has to come. You know there are certain verbs after which certain preposition must come. Huh? Tanusu, tanusu ala, tanusu ala, annahu man yagib akhtar min ispuaini. Now here comes your jawab. Where is the adatu shart? Man. man. And what is man? Ismu shart jazimun. What is it? Ismu shart jazimun. Tajzimu fialaini. Huh? And where is the fialu shart? Yaqib. And where is jawabu shart? Yutwa. Kaidu is your knife file. What is kaidu? Knife file. Mudaf. Mudafili. Lan aghiba baada haza inshallah. I won't remain after after this. Now look at this, brothers and sisters. This is something we got to understand. But I am going to leave it aside for the time being. We come back to it. Kam maratin kultali ha kaza. How many times did you say? No, no. Here, kam has two meanings. One is to ask question. How many times did you say? The other one is. Saying in a in a in a wondrous way, kam maratan kultali hakada. How many times have you said this to me? Huh? Not I'm not asking an answer from you. That tell me how many times. I'm just expressing my surprise. Huh? Huh? If I say, look at me, my brothers and sisters. If I say, kam kitaban indaka. Do you have? And if I say, I change my tone. Come kitab bin indaka. How many books you have? I'm surprised at the books you have. No, I don't expect an answer. But from the first one, I do expect an answer. Are you with me? So this concept is coming uh, in here uh, to explain us how we will use come. And they are called different. They have different names, huh? One is called Kam Stefamia and one is Kam Khabariya. Huh? We are going to learn later on. Uh, not uh, necessary that we should go in detail about that. Huh? But this is what uh, you have to understand. When it is for a surprise, Sister Sukhaina, then you will end it with a sign of exclamation. Are you with me? Highlight that. If it is other way around, then there will be a question mark. Are you with me? Huh? There is another sign there. One will have a question mark and one will have a sign exclamation. Are you? And there are still more details, Brother Hassan. We get to look into more details later on. Look at this, Brother and Sister. Kam marraten. It is majroor. Why? Yes, but it is majroor because this is for the kam al khabariya of surprise. Huh? Now watch, brothers and sisters. If I tell you, kam kitaban indaka is the farm, and when I say kam kitabin indaka, it's surprise. Are you with me? Maybe I did not say it properly in the first place. But this is how you will differentiate. Huh? Kam, kam kitaban indaka. How many books you have? And then I will say, kam kitaban indaka. So then you will have a sign of exclamation. It's coming, inshallah. You will see the details later on. Huh? Okay. What is the answer? What is the Yasser saying? Ma kuntu aghibu illa bi uzr. Translation, brother. I did not remain absent 
I never used to remain absent except reason. with a reason. Huh? Okay. <coughs> Brothers and sisters, what is the answer? Mahma. What is Mahma? Huh? Whatever. 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 What is Mahma? It's Mushart. What is it? It's Mushart. See, we are going to get all these things here now. Huh? Mahma Yakun. What is Yakun? Fialushan. Huh? Whatever be your excuse. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Whatever be your excuse. Falan Yukbala Badalan. It will not be accepted. Whatever is your excuse, you will be fired. Huh? Your enrollment will be folded. Huh? Now tell me, brothers and sisters, far come, far has come. Why? Huh? Lan has come, and after lan, what will come? Jumla. No, lan. After lan, what will come? Fial mudariya mansu. But how will you describe your jawab ushart? First, yes, first we will say uh, fa alfa'u waqiyatun fi jawab ushart. It occurred. I'm going to write it for you, inshallah, uh, later on. It's all written also in the handout. Uh, alfa'u waqiyatun. Maybe you should write down. Uh, Alfa'u Waqiatun Fi Jawabi Sharti This is what you will describe for Fa. And then what will you describe Lan? Harfu Nasbin Nafyin Wal Mustaqbilin are you with me? Huh? Remember? Fine. And then what will you say to Yukubala? Fialun? Mularion? Lil Majhul. Huh? This is Lil Majhul. Mansubun. Bilfata. Are you with me? And where is the knife file? Mustatir. Huh? Takdiru huwa. And what is ba'da? Zarf. And al-ana? Also zarf, you know. Okay. But it is now ba'da al-ana. Huh? Al-ana is now majroor because of ba'da. Are you with me? Now you will say al-jumlatu al-fialiyatu. Are you with me? Is jumla failure. What will you say? Fi mahalli jazmin jawab sharta. So whenever fa will come, you will have to say and explain in this way. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? But I am going to do it a lot. I will do so many times. And every time I, we come across it, inshallah, you will memorize it. It will become part of your memory, inshallah. Today is the first day, huh, brother? So, but I'm sure by the end of the day, you will be very comfortable, inshallah. And tomorrow, you will become even more strong. And when you come on Monday, you will say, I knew this from my childhood. Huh? I knew it from long, long time ago. Okay. Okay, now, see, I'm telling you so many things, probably, you know, a teacher may not go in that much detail, huh? but I would love to go in detail because I wanted to know myself also what's happening. Okay, brother. What is Yakun, Sister Mamuna? What is Yakun? Kana Yakun. So it's Fial Nakis. Are you with me? What is it? Fial Nakis. 
We need, what do we need in Fial Nakis? Ism. Where is Ism? Hmm? Al Usr. That is your Ism. Huh? Because Ism Kana Marfu. Huh? Okay, brother, where is the Khabar Kana? Huh? Okay, let me tell you before you uh, scratch your head, huh? because you might say the Jumla, no, no, no. No, no. Huh? Mahma. That is your <laughs> mashallah. <laughs> but you know, uh, uh, you have, I could not figure out. When I was explained that, I said, okay, I'll remember it now. Huh? Mahma is your fi mahali nasbin khabar kahana. Yakun. Khabar yakun. Got the idea? Huh? Because, brother, if kahana comes, then I must know where the ism is. And if I know where the ism is, then I must know where the khabar is. So, Udru is your ism kana, and Mahma, which came Mukaddam. Huh? It came Mukaddam, and that is your khabar yakun. Got the idea? Write it down if you wish to, for your reference, you know. Because someday you will stand up and teach, and there will be a very smart student sitting in your class, and, and she or he will ask you, where is the khabar khana? <laughs> we must know where it is. Huh? Okay? Yad khulu nauman. Nauman enters. Now, Mudar is saying, man jaa but the man has come. What is man? Tell me, brothers and sisters, what is man? Ismu shart jazimun. Tajizimu fialaini. Fine, brothers and sisters. Where is it, Sister Mamuna? Where is the fialu shart? Jaa. Wait, it is mati. We need mudariya majizum. So what will you say? Female jasmine. <laughs> because had it been mudarya, it would have been majizum. Remember? Had it been mudarya, it would have been definitely majizum. But because madi came, so I will say ja'a, felu madin, mabnin ala, fata, fi mahali, jasmine, felu shart. Got the idea? But I, I think Arabic grammar is beautiful. <laughs> You know, if we understand the rules properly, Sister Manas, then everything is fun. What did I say? It's fun. It's joy to do all these things, inshallah. I'm not done, huh? I'm not done, huh? Okay. Man jaa mutakhiran. Mutakhiran, sister. Hal. Hal. Hal kaisa hai janaab ka? Sister Arifa. Hal kaisa hai janab ka? Kya khayal hai aap ka? Okay, okay. That is your hal, brothers and sisters. Fala. Fa has come. Huh? So there has to be a reason. La yadukhul. So what is the la lahiya? What is yadukhul? No. Yadukhul is majzum. So you are tempted to say that this is your jawabushat. But sister Mainas, Yadukhul is majzum because of la nahiya. Not in its natural state. No, no, no. Hold your horses. <laughs> no, 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 no. Sister Sukhaina. Yadukhul is felun mudarion majzum because of la nahiya. Are you with me? Yadukhul. And where is the file? Mustatir. Takdiruhu huwa. Hatta is like hatta uh, an. Uh, so this is nawasibu mudariya. It will give, it will make fail mudariya mansub. That's all. We are going to learn about this also. Uh, whenever you see hatta, the an is hidden there. Uh, an mudmara. Uh, Okay? Now, brothers and sisters, look at me carefully. La 
लाना ही नाफिया अशगाला वॉट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ अशगाला अशगाला इज फेल मुदार मनसूब उन बिल फता वेर इज द फाइल मुस्तर तकदीर हु अना सो वॉट इज द वर्ब शागाला वॉट इज द वर्ब राइट इट डाउन शागाला यश गालू आप क्या पढ़ रहे हैं? What did I miss? Oh, I beg your pardon. I missed it. Okay. Anyway, we are coming to that also. Okay. So, hatta yasta zina. Are you with me? So, what is yasta zina? Yasta zina. Mansub. Why? I'm mudmera. Huh? Fine. What kind of a verb is this? Form ten. Ista zina. Yasta zinu. Are you with me, Brother Hasan? Form ten. Now tell me the meaning. Huh? La yadhul. He should not enter until he asks for permission. He asks. Huh? In form ten, seeking and asking is there, and unless he asks for permission or seeks permission, are you with me? Okay. Now I'll tell you. Huh? Fala. Yadhul hatta yasta zina. Are you with me? I describe it. La nahiya yadhul majzum because of la nahiya. I describe hatta and yasta zina. File mustatir takdiru hua. Okay. Now I will say al jumla tul fiyaliyatu. What will I say? Al jumla tul fiyaliyatu fi mahali jazmin. Jawab was shared. Did you get it? The whole sentence. I told you, all of these, uh, brothers and sisters, the form will come, and it will result into either jumla ismia or it will result in jumla failure. And then we will describe it. Fi mahali jasmin. You know something? You are writing. But at the end of the day, you would have memorized it, <laughs> because I'll be saying so many times, and you will be repeating with me so many times. Are you with me? Inshallah. Huh? Now we come to the next sentence. Ana sifun, raitu ka mashgulan. I saw you. Mashgulan. I saw you. Busy. For dakhal tu, so I entered. Hatta la. Ashgalaka. So, what is Ashgala? Shagala, Yashgalu. To distract. Huh? Okay. Now, remember, I want you to do something. You know, in the first hatta, hatta, yasta, as in, write down till. What will you write down? Till. What will you write down? Till or ila? Uh, write down both. Huh? Ila or till. And in the next hatta, in English, you will write down so as. And in Arabic, you will write down likai. What will you write down? See the meaning changed. Huh? In one hatta, the meaning was till. Till he asked for permission. Are you with me? And in the second, it is so as not to distract you. Huh? Are you with me? Now this is what will come later on in the exercise, huh? in the dars. Doctor Abdurrahim will explain us this, you know. So hatta will have two meanings. In both cases, hatta has got in hidden into it, and it will make fail mudaria, 
Mansur. But in one, the meaning will be till, until. And in the other, the meaning will be so as. Huh? G? No, both of them will have. As I, as I said, Sister Manas, in both the cases, un is hidden. Huh? Un is hidden. Well then, sisters, are you with me? I'm explaining you in, in greater detail. Huh? So that, inshallah, even if you retain in your mind about 75 to 80 percent, and later on you will revise, inshallah, you will have 100 percent. Uh, understanding, inshallah. Huh? Sister Sumaya, remember we have today and tomorrow. Both days we'll be concentrating on lesson 15, inshallah. Yadukhulur Murakib. Murakib enters. And when Murakib enters, he will bring new rule. <laughs> of Brahman. Okay. Ha'um. What is Ha'um? Hudu. Write down khuzu. What is this haum? This is ismu fiel amar. What is it? Ismu fiel amar. It does not have any other form. Haum means khuzu. Take. What shall we take? I'lanan mafulun bihi. No. Ha'u. Where is the file? Mustatir takdiruhu antum. Antum. Uh, this wow is not file. Huh? This is a different kind of uh, ismu fiel. Remember, it does not have madi, mudariya, nothing. Only this form. Huh? And it is called ismu fiel. Ismu, let me write down. Huh? Ismu fielen amren. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Ismu Felin Amrin. Just write down uh, this Ismu Felin Amrin. It will come, inshallah, later on. Okay. Elanan. What is Elanan? Huh? Okay. It's, okay. Where is it coming from? A'lana. A'lana. Form 4. A'lana to announce. Huh? A'lana yu'linu. Okay, brothers and sisters. Did you get it? Yes. A'lan is your master. From A'lana yu'linu. Am I gabrifying you? Am I scaring you? Inshallah, we'll do it. Huh? But and brother, I'm not done, huh? Sister Nasrin. In every, every word, something coming. Mohimman. Mohimman. What is it? Not. It is not. But it has got mu there. It is Ismu Fahil. Oh, now, Sister Sukhena, if you said Ismu Fahil, now tell me what is the verb, you know. How many sambosas you should bring? <laughs> Ahamma. What is it? Ahamma. Yohimmu. Uh, mashallah, mashallah. See, inshallah, inshallah, your knowledge will become so strong that in the Quran, every word you will be able to figure out. You will trace it root, its root, you know. We may not know the meaning. For meaning, uh, we have to go to the dictionary. Uh, but at least you will have some idea how the verb, you know, what the root is. How the verb is, if the noun has been made out of it, you'll now. Okay, brothers and sisters, Ahamma, give me Mudarya. You, him, are you with me? Now make it is some file. Mohimmun, huh? Is some file became Mohim. 
Sister Mayanas, is it an Urdu word? No? Ye cheez badi mohim hai. Mohim. It is said in Urdu also. I just wanted to say that it's not Urdu, it's Arabic. <laughs> okay? Urdu borrowed it without saying thank you. Uh, okay, brothers and sisters. Uh, uh, important. Mohim, I thought, is very common. Must, must be in Farsi also. Important. Uh, yeah. In Somali also, maybe. Important. Uh, in Somali also. See? Maybe in uh, Soheli also. Everybody borrowed from? Arabic. Arabic. They all borrowed from Arabic. Huh? Okay, brothers and sisters. Hadihi khamsatu kutayi baatun. Booklets. Now this is we are going to learn. So I am not going to go in detail now. Remember one thing, brother. Ismu tasgir. Huh? Jabalun Jubayl. Huh? Abdun Ubaid. Hasanun Hussain. Huh? Now these were three letters. All these words were three letters. What happens when there are four letters? What happens when there are five letters? This is what we are going to learn in this lesson later on. Huh? It's very easy and very interesting. I'm going to leave it. Kotayji Baatun huh? comes from Kitab. Comes from Kitab. How many letters in Kitab? Four letters. Huh? So it is Kotayji Bun. Now make it Jama Kotayji Baatun. Okay? These are five booklets. Huh? These are five booklets. Mufidatin. Useful. And this is a nath for Kutayyibatin. Tahwi containing Kisasan Islamiyatan. Clear? They contain Kisasan Islamic stories. Huh? Okay. Huh? Faman. Are you with me? What is the fa? Harfu atf. From man yakraha. So what is this yakra? Fehlushat. This is your fehlushat. And ha is mafulun bihi. Wa atf. What is the next one? Yujib. What is yujib? Okay. Now, Sister Sukhena, you got to tell me the verb. It's easy to say mautuf. Aja mashallah, mashallah. See, ajaba yujibu. And you make it yujibu majizum, it became yujib. Alhamdulillah. You, you don't know how happy I feel when your answers are coming uh, so accurately. But and sister, this is amazing. Now your mind is really understanding uh, the intricacies of all the verbs their forms and how they become majzum, what is being dropped. Huh? Okay, I write down here, brothers. Ajaba U G Bu. Okay, make it majzum. You jib. Huh? I have to, two sukuns came, so I have to change it now. You jib. Got that? What is the meaning of you jib? To answer. Huh? So, the one who reads it and answers as ilatil varidati, the questions mentioned, fi akhiriha, at the end of it. Okay, brothers and sisters. Fa lahu jaizatun. Fa has come. Why? Jubla ismiya. What is lahu? Jar majur shibu jumla khabar mukaddam. Where is muftida? Jaizatun. Now tell me, sister Mamuna, you had a man which is adatu shart, tajizimu, fialaini, ismu shart, tajizimu fialaini, and we came to yakra, it is fialu shart, then harfu atf came, and yujib. Is mautufunala yakra? Where is your jawabu shart? 
So what will you say? First you will describe Lahu, Khabar, Jaizatun, Muftada. Then you will say Al Jumlatu, Al Ismiyatu, Fi Mahali, Jasmin, Jawabushat. Got the idea? Alhamdulillah. Sister Hafsa, Brother Hassan, did you get it, brother? Inshallah. Huh? The sisters are very strong. Uh, there are two reasons. One reason is that Allah has blessed them with uh, a knack for learning languages. The second reason in this class is that we are outnumbered. <laughs> okay. Four to one, brother. If we are one, they are four. <laughs> Alhamdulillah. Okay, did you get the idea, brothers and sisters? Let's finish the sentence. Huh? Again, فَمَنْ فَمَنْ أَرَادَ أَنْ يَشْتَرِيكَ فِي هَذِهِ الْمُسَابَكَةِ Okay, brothers and sisters. I want you to also observe how beautiful the lesson is. Each sentence has got uh, sharp and jawab sharp. Now, see, did we get these things in the previous lessons throughout from book one to now? No, we did not get it. Now we are getting in wholesale. Huh? Every line is sharp, jawab sharp. Why? Because this is what we are studying. And that is the, the beauty and uh, vision and farsightedness of Dr. Abdurrahim. If he wants to explain you Shart and Jawabu Shart, he will create a dialogue in which mostly he will use these sentences. Huh? So here we are, brothers and sisters, for man arada. So man ismu Shart. Jazimu, tajizimu fi'alaini. And where is fi'alu Shart? What is arada? It's Mahdi. Huh? So you will say, Fi Mahali Chazmin. Fi Alu Shat. How will you say? Arada. Fi Alu Madin Mabnun Allah Fata. Fi Mahali Jazmin. Fi Alu Shat. Are you with me? Fine, brothers and sisters. An Harfu Naspin Ba Mastariyin. Yashtarika. Fi Alu Mudariyun. Mansubun. File. Mustatir takdiruhu huwa al mustar al muawwal fi mahalli nasbin mafulun bihi. Okay. Fi harshar hadihi isam majur and al musabakati badal. Now tell me what is al musabakati? Mustar. Sabaka yu sabiku. Mashallah, mashallah. What is the meaning of sabaka? To compete. Yeah, compete. Uh, to compete. So master is competition. Uh, what is the pattern of the master? Mufa'alatun. Or fi'alun. Two forms. But mufa'alatun. So this is form three, master. Uh, okay, but the fa has come. al uh, uh, Vakiyatun fi jawabushat. It is occurring for jawabushat. Then what is this? Lam. Lam Muhammad. And what is this? No. Yusajjil. Felun mudariun majzumun bi sukum. Because of Lam Muhammad. Where is the file? Mustatir. Takadiruhu huwa. Fine. So you got this also. Yusajjil means he must register his name with me. Are you with me? You got the idea? You can translate Alhamdulillah. Now, did we get our Jawabushat? Huh? You might say Yusajjil is Majizum, so it is Jawabushat. No, no, no. It is not in its natural state. Are you with me? It is Majizum because of? And what is Lamu Amar? Talab, and that is why Fa came. So you will have to describe huh? the Lamu Amar, then Fail Mudariya Majizum, then where is the file, and where is the Mafulun Bihi, etc., etc. And then you will say Al Jumlatul Fialiyatu, 
فی محلی جزمن جواب و شرط کارتا ایدیا؟ الحمدلله الحمدلله We can carry on without taking break But I think we'll take a break لی نشرب شای انشاءالله But short break huh, brother? Let us uh, be quick huh, انشاءالله uh, We thank Sister Sukhaina for treating the class with such delicious uh, uh, goodies. <laughs> May Allah bless you and your family. <laughs> yeah, inshallah. We pray for everyone, whosoever, in a very, even in a small way, whosoever participates in making the class a little comfortable. Some people bring donuts and tea and milk. May Allah bless you all, inshallah. We are like a family, brothers and sisters. We are all like a family here, inshallah. And we will carry with us the memories of this class later on, inshallah. Huh? Huh? Sweet memories, huh? inshallah. Okay, brothers and sisters, we are back. Huh? Alhamdulillah. So here is, again I repeat, Paman Arada and Yashtarika. What is Yashtarika, brothers and sisters? Ishtaraka, to participate. Form 8, huh? inshallah. Huh? Ibrahim, Ya Shaykhu, La Najiduka fi Maktabika, fi Kasirin min Ahyanin. Kasirin min Ahyanin means many times. Fi huh? Kasirin min Marratin. Huh? Or you can say, fi Marratin. Kathiratin. Same thing. Ahyanin. This is plural. Many times. La najiduka. We do not find you. Fi maktabika. In your office. Many times. What is Murakab saying? In. What is it? What is in? Harfushat. Jazimun, tajzimu fi alayni. Okay. Lam. What is lam? Harfu jasmin. Wa nafiyan. Wa kalbin. And what is tajidu? Fayalun. Mudariun. Majzumun. Bi. Adifinun. And where is the file? Wow. And what is this noon doing here? Noonu vikaya. Huh? And Yamuti Kalim is? Mafulmi. Hmm? If you don't find me, that is the thing. If you don't find me, Fi Maktabi, in my office, now Sister Mehmuna tell me one thing. Tajidu is Majzum. But is it Fialu Shart? No. It's not in its natural state. Ji? No. What will you say here? What will you say here? That lam, as you will describe lam, huh? and then you will say tajidu, which is majzum. But it is majzum because of the lam. Then you will say tajidu, you will describe tajidu file, and then you will say lam tajidu fi mahalli jasmin fi alushar. Or even you don't have to say lam, you can just say tajidu fi mahali jasmin fi alushat. Did you get it, Sister Mehmuna? Inshallah. In other words, we look for the natural state of fi alushat majzum. And if it is not, then it is fi mahali jasmin. Got the idea? Inshallah. Fa sa tajidunani. So fa came and then seen came. Huh? So tanfis. Huh? See? Because of seen, fa has to come. And then if the seen comes, then brothers and sisters, the fail mudariya cannot be majizum. It has to be marfu. Huh? Sa tajidunani. How will you describe? Tajiduna failun mudariyon. Marfu'un bi subuti noon. And the next noon is Noonu Vikaya. And then Ya Mutakalam 
مفعول به where is the fa'il al waw fi maktab al mudir now we know what it is fi afjar maktabi ism majrur wa huwa mudaf and mudaf ilayhi now brothers and sisters what will you say satajidunani what is that al jumlatul fi'aliyatu fi mahalli jazmin jawab ushan got the idea see in other words as i said earlier in the class whenever you will say fa as a jawab ushan waqiyatun fi jawab ushan then we have to describe that sentence either it is jumla ismiya or it is jumla fi'liya and we will say fi mahalli jazmin now brother and sister this is an extreme detail huh? detail 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 you are describing it there is nothing more to describe huh? and if you can do this brother and sister alhamdulillah then you have really understood the rules uh, very well alhamdulillah sometimes you know the teachers do not uh, go into that much detail you know but i feel going into detail and for one reason because we have been preparing ourselves from day one for for this kind of a situation so our our background is strong in analysis inshallah huh? i hope you agree with me inshallah huh? now the the muraqib is saying to the teacher ya fadilat shaykh o oh, respectable shaykh in abdullah fi maktabi translation truly abdullah is in my office ha huh? okay so what is abda ismu inna wa huwa mudaf al mudaf ilayhi where is khabar inna jar majru shibu jumla khabar very good now comes in in ni'tadhara ilayka i'tadhara what is it i'tadhara form 8 what is it i'tadhara what is the meaning of i'tadhara to apologize to apologize in harfu shartin jazimun tajzimu fi'laini fine brothers and sisters but what is i'tadhara fi'lu madin mabniyun ala fata fi mahalli jazmin fi al shart got the idea ha ilayka jar majur ha where is the file for yatazara mustatir takdiruhu huwa yadullu ala abdullah ha fine afatasmahu lahu bi dukhul afatasmahu lahu fi dukhul what is a so what happened this what kind of jumla is this it is victoria it is victoria queen victoria because fa came after it instead of coming fa if you change hal fa hal eh are you with me now why did fa come harf o istifam it is part of talab uh, it is part of talab how many things are in talab amar la mu amar la nahiya and istifam uh, if these things are there then the condition of talab are fulfilled and then fa has to come so fa came because it became talab because of istifam afa tasmahu will you permit him to enter are you with me brothers and sisters so why did fa come uh, jawab us shart uh, talabiyatun what is it talabiyatun uh, jawab us shart is talabiyatun uh, tasmahu is fi'lun mudhari'un marfu'un bi dhamma fa'il mustatir taqdiru anta fine al mudarris naam ya ahmad iqra al ayat al waridata fi ad dars 
of your brother and sister, Ahmad is saying now, بعد الاستعاغتي والبسملتي يا أيها الذين آمنوا Okay, brothers and sisters, what is after that? In. Uh, in. What is in? Harfu shart. Jazimu, tajizimu, fialaini. What is in? Harfu shart. Jazimu, tajizimu, fialaini. Okay. Let us see now. Tansuru. Is it majizum? Yes. Yes. It is in its natural state of majzum. What is the verb? Tansuruna. Are you with me? Tansuruna. So in Tansuru, in Tansuru, Felun, Mudarion, Majzumun, B, Adafinun. Where is the file? Alwaw. What is Allah? Bafulun bihi. Okay. What is yan surkum? Jawabush. Is it majzum? Yes. It is in its natural state. Do we need fa? No. We don't need fa. Because it is coming in its natural state. You know? Yan surkum. Felun mudarion majzumun bi sukun. Fail. Mustatir takdiruhu. Huwa. Yadullu Allah. Allah. Huh? Well, you submit. What is you submit? Majzum. Mautufun ala yansur. Akadama mafulun bihi mudafilihi. Ibrahim is now asking, Limadha juzimat afalul waridatu fi hadhi al ayah ya fadilata shaykh. Why did the uh, verbs were made majzum in this ayah. Why were the verbs made majzum in this ayah? Are you with me, brothers and sisters? What is the answer? Al Mudaris. In Adatu Shartin. Tajizimu Fialaini. Nah. For example, in Tajtahid. Tanjah. In Tazhab ila Suki Azhab Maka. Are you with me? Do you see in both the sentences? Tashtahid Fialushat. Tanjah Jawabushat. Tazhab Fialushat. Azhab Jawabushat. Yusamma Avalu Fialushat. Well, Aharu Jawabushat. وفي آيات الكريمة فعل الشرط تنصر وجوابه ينصر والفعل يثبت موطوف على ينصر أرجو أن تكونوا قد فهمتم I hope you have understood it أتستطيع أن تذكر آيات أخرى تحوي إن يا ياسر can you mention? Are you able to mention? Atastatiu? Are you able to mention another ayah containing in Yayasir? Nam. Bi Allah. With the help of Allah. Kala ta'ala. In. Ta'udu. Na'ud. Is it clear? Everybody? What is Ta'udu? What is the verb? Ada. Ada. To return. Ada. Ya'udu. Okay? So, ta'uduna. So, noon is dropped. And then, na'udu became na'ud. Are you with me? Inshallah. Huh? If you return, we will return. Okay? Asanta. أجمكنك أن تذكر آية أخرى يا نعمان؟ نعم بعون الله قال تعالى بدأت this is such a beautiful آية وإلا تغفر لي وترحمني أكون من الخاسرين 
brother wa illa what is illa in la huh? remember write it down huh? it's it's mentioned in the book also it will come in plus la is equal to illa huh? so where is your harf uh, shart in in huh? and what is this la this is la nafia what is it la nafia This is La Nafia. So what is Tagfir? Fialushat. It is in natural state. Huh? Remember this is La and Nafia. Not La Nahia. Huh? In if you don't forgive if you don't forgive me. Are you with me? What is the translation? If you don't forgive me. Huh? So in La tagfir li. So tagfir is fi'lu shart. Uh, it is majzum. Where is the file? Mustatir. Takdiruhu anta. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And li is jar majrur. Uh, remember, gafara, always li of jar will come. Uh, wa tarhamni. So what is tarham? Ba'atufun ala. Tagfir. Huh? Now, Tagfir will always come with Harf Charli. And Tarham will get a direct Mafulun Bihi. Huh? Nunu Vikaya and Yamutakalim Mafulun Bihi. What is the Jawab? Akun. Is it properly Majizum? Yes. Akunu became Akun. So, this is your Jawab Ushar. Huh? No need for Fa or anything else. Huh? Min al Khashirin. If you do not forgive me and have mercy on me, then I will be of the loser. Huh? Inshallah. Al Mudaris. MashaAllah. Illa huna asluha in wala al nafia. Ahmad. Asammata adwatun ukhra tajizimu fialani ya ustad. Are there any other instruments that will make the fail mudariya majizum? Al-mudaris. Naam. In. What is in? Harfun. It's a particle. Wa hunaka asharatu asma'in. Tajizimu fialaini. There are ten isms, nouns, which also will make two verbs Majizum. Ahamuha, important of them are, Ahamuha, important of them are, Man. Nah. Huh? So, Man yamal miskala zarratin khairan yarahu. So, what is Man, brothers and sisters? Ismu shad. Tajizimu fialaini. Huh? And what is yamal? Fialu shad. And where is jawabu shad? Yara only. Huh? Both are majzum in its natural state. Huh? Very good, brother. And then ma. Wa ma taf'alu min khairin ya'lamhu Allah. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? So, what is ma? Ismu shart. Tajizimu fi'alain. Where is the fi'alu shart? Taf'alu. Fi'alun mudariyun majzumun bi hazifinun. And brother, where is the jawab ushar? Ya'lam. Got the idea? Ya'lam. Is it clear, brother and sisters? Whatever you do uh, in good deeds, uh, Allah knows it. Allah knows it. Fa'ala ya fa'alu, to do. Huh? And alima ya alamu, to know. What is the next one, brothers and sisters? Mata. No, mata is a zarf. And zarf is a noun. Huh? Iza is also zarf. And zarf is a noun. Huh? So mata, write down the meaning. Whenever. 
What will be the meaning of Mata? Whenever. Example. Mata to Safir. Usafir. Both are Majusun. What is the meaning? Whenever you travel, I will travel. So both are Majusun. One is Fialushar and other is Jawabushar. Aina. Wherever. Aina means wherever. Aina taskun, askun. Huh? Are you with me? Wherever you live, I will live. Huh? So both are majizum. Wa kathiran ma talhakuha ma azaida. No, brother, you can add to aina an extra ma. What is it? Ma a zaida. Uh, many times, many times, ma extra is joined uh, uh, with aina. Uh, for what reason? Taqid, for emphasis. Uh, here it is, brother. Lit taqid. Now, aina ma takunu. What is takunu? B. Takunu is B. Huh? Is it Majizum? Yes. yes. What is originally? Takununa. What is originally? Takununa. Huh? So, Ainama Takunu, wherever you be, Yudrik, see, Majizum. Yudrik, Kumul, Mautu. The death will overtake you or will catch you. Huh? Wherever you be, Huh? You can be in the vault of CIB Bank, ten stories underground. The moth will come and meet you there. Will catch you when the time is up. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Sister Matina, Ayya has come. No, Ayya is also what is Ayya? What is Ayya? Ismushart. It can come as a it can come as a ismushart. Huh? Okay? And it will be mansu. Okay? Has to be mansu. Huh? So, what is the meaning of mata? Whenever. What is the meaning of aina? Wherever. And what will be the meaning of ayya? Whichever. Ayya muajamin najid fil maktabati. Translation, brother. Whichever dictionary you find in the bookstore, buy it. Are you with me? Ayya, Mojamin, Najid. See, why Ayya became Mansub? Because of Najid. Najid. That is the verb. Najid fi maktabati nashtarihi. What is the translation? Whichever dictionary we find in the bookstore, we will buy it. Huh? We will buy it. Do you see two verbs, majizum, najid, and nashtari? They are in their natural state of being majizum. Huh? Very good, brother. Oh, again, mahma came. Mahma huh? takul. Huh? What is the meaning? Mahma takul. Whatever you say. Nusaddik. Huh? We believe. Nusaddik. Huh? Huh? So what is Nusaddik? What is the verb? Saddaka. Form? Form to. Saddaka. Yusaddiku. Masdar? Tasdik. What will be the masdar? Tasdik. MashaAllah. Alhamdulillah. Inshallah, we'll finish the lesson and then the uh, rest of it will continue tomorrow. Inshallah. Okay, brothers and sisters. If hamu haza darsa jayidan. Okay. Every sentence is so meaningful in our this dars. Uh, Dr. Abdurrahim has done wonders, you know, in explaining us. For man, okay, man has come. What is man? 
יש מושב, תזיזי מופי עלייני. פאהימה. So I'm going to catch Sister Mamuna today all the time. פאהימה. Huh? What is פאהימה, Sister Mamuna? פי אל מאדי. Are you with me? מבנונה לה? פתא. פי מהלי? ג'זמין. פי אל מושב. דבר די די, אינשאללה. פאמן פאהימה הדה דרסה. אוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהוהו
Ya Ahmad is saying, Kulluna sayahduru, inshallah. All of us will attend, will come. Al Mudaris, Mata Tatuna. Tatuna, what is Tatuna? Ata Yati, what is it? Ata Yati. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Let us conjugate Yati. Yati, Yati Yani, Yatuna. Same way. Tati, Tati Yani, Tatuna. Felun, Mudarion, Marfun, Bisbutinun. Where is the file? Alba. So, Mata Tatuna. Translation. When will you come? Huh? What is Ahmad saying? Mata Tati Nati. He's selling to the teacher. When you come, we'll come. <laughs> so, what is Mata? Huh? What is Mata? Ismu Shart. Tajizimu Fialaini. Where is uh, Sister Mamuna? Where is Fialu Shart? Tati. Is it Majizum? Yes, it is Majizum in its natural state. Huh? And where is Jawabu Shart? Nati. It is majzum, its natural state. What is niyati? Fehlun mudariyun majzumun bi hadfi harfi illa. And where is the file? Mustatir. Taqdeeru nahnu. MashaAllah. But still the jumla shartiya will come. Till the end. The jumla shartiya, that is the beauty of Dr. Abdurrahim. Wo nahi chhodenge. Till the end. Okay. Al mudaris. Saati asata rabiata inshallah. I will come at four o'clock. Now Ahmad is saying, Fi ayi faslin najlisu. Are you with me? Translation? In which class shall we sit? Fi ayi. See, ayi is majroor because of fi. Now the last sentence of the dars. And it has to be jumra shartiya. Al mudaris. Ayya faslin najid khaliyan. Translation, brother and sister. Whichever classroom you find empty, uh, najlis me. Okay, so what is ayya? Ismu shart. Chajizimu fialaini. And it is also mafulun bihi. Now, faslin is mudafilihi. Najid, sister Mamuna, najid is fialu shart. In its natural state. Huh? Khaliyan, this is mafulun bihi. Huh? Mafulun bihi. Then where is jawabu shart? Najlis. Huh? In its natural state. Huh? Do we need fa here? No, no, we don't need. Fihi jar majur. Alhamdulillah. Did you find it interesting, brothers and sisters? Huh? And tomorrow we will continue. Huh? And if there is a need, we will still do it on Monday also. So that you are all very strong. And then you don't have to write. Everything is now stored in your hard drive. And you will be able to say it, inshallah, without difficulty. Rabbana atina fi dunya asanatam wa fil akhirati asanatam wa kina adhaban nar. Rabbana hablana min azwajina wa zuriyatina kurrata ayunin. Wajalna lil muttaqina imama.